get box must do unboxing what's up everyone it's jill from what joe wears and today i have a where is it short story box i haven't had one of these since like summer i put them on the back burner because i felt like their styles were more catered toward like business and I don't go into an office, so I didn't need businessy wear. But um, they did say that they, I think, pack some cozy stuff. So maybe their style's changing a little bit or they're catering a little bit more. So we'll see what's in here. Um, short story is for shorties, it's for petites. And I am. I want to say, I always say like five, three and a half, like almost five, four, maybe I'm five, four. I don't know. But uh, anytime I've kind of measured myself, I feel like I just fall short. So I always say five, three and a half, whatever. Um, so anyways, let's see what's in here. Kind of excited because I haven't had one of these in so long. So first off, we have some jewelry and they are a pair of rose gold earrings are really cute. Amano Studios, handcrafted in California. So they are 18 karat rose gold and Eva Coat Resist Tarnish and Hypoallergenic, which is great because I do have sensitive skin. Um, they are like a hammered rose gold. I used to exclusively love rose gold and then I started getting into more like the just plain silver. But I do love rose gold every once in a while, so we will try those on, or maybe, we'll see. I might, I might just hold them up. All right, first little bundle. Second little bundle, looks like some sweaters. Okay, first shirt. So this is by Claudia Richard. Eh. It's plaid, but it's like a very soft, kind of felt, feels like pajamas. Let's see. Ninety-six percent polyester and four percent spandex. So it has these gold buttons, which I do not care for at all. I'm not a gold, gold, gold person. And I feel like those buttons look a little cheap. So I'll try it on, but I'm not really into that. Next, we have a top by Gilly. This is, again, kind of a fancier shirt. A little tie at the bottom. Love the color. Love the dull mini sleeve. So we'll see what this looks like. It's a little fancy for me. I'm not sure. We'll see. Next we have, a, it looks like a pair of leggings. This is by, I've heard this brand before, but I've never said it. Lissy, Liss or Lissy? Okay, just some plain black leggings. Looks like they have a good stretch at the top. So we'll try these on. Nice heavy material, appreciate that. Cause I feel like all the leggings I've been getting and all the joggers I've been getting lately have been lightweight, like spring summer ones. Where are all the heavier weight joggers? All right, next we have a sweater by Petite Principle. Oh, this is cute, super cute. That's definitely my style. Again, nice color. Let's see, I do like these buttons on here. This is, oh, 100% acrylic. Ugh, I hate acrylic. It doesn't feel bad though. I will definitely try it on. It doesn't feel itchy or anything. And I think when it has this open knit, that's helpful. There's the buttons. All right, lastly, we have another sweater by Yemak sweater, Yemak, Y-E-M-A-K. 
This feels like it's acrylic again. Yep. This one feels not as soft as the other one. So yeah. I mean, I haven't contact I haven't been in contact with them in so long. They don't know that I don't like these like synthetic materials. So not really their fault. Um, I did reach out to them because this box came as kind of a surprise and they said that um, it must have been rescheduled from before they switched over where you could like select if you wanted a box every month or just on demand or whatever. So they apologized for that. Um, but uh, yeah, didn't order this and came as a surprise. So anyways, let's do a try on. We'll see what we think. Okie dokie, here is the cardigan and the leggings. These leggings feel really nice. They have a seam down the front, so they make it a little bit fancier, I guess. They are the perfect length for me. And they suck you in here at the top, so they feel really nice. I don't know if I need leggings, though, black leggings. I'll have to look in my drawer. I know that I have a lot of athletic -y ones, and these would be a little bit more dressy. Um, so we'll see. The sweater, I like it. It doesn't feel as bad on as I thought it would. I think it's cute. I just really honestly do not wear cardigans. I like the color though. I like that it has pockets. I went ahead and just put on this plaid shirt. Um, I don't think it's long enough for leggings, but I wouldn't get it regardless. Even if I, you know, tried it on with jeans, I just know that this is not, this is not a shirt for me. And yeah, it's super soft, but yeah, it just, there's tabs and the gold buttons. I just, no, not me. I have my own jeans on and then I put on this little short sleeve dolman top. It is cute. I like it. I think it looks so good from the front and then you turn to the side and it's just weird. It doesn't look as bad on that side, but it's just so puffy. I don't know. I like the sleeves a lot. I really love the color. But again, it's probably polyester. Yep, 100% polyester. Trying to do more um, natural fibers to not getting the polyesters and the acrylics. So cute, but I will probably pass. Here is this last sweater. This is pretty cute. I do kind of like it. Love the balloony sleeves and the v-neck and the buttons. The color is so pretty. It's a good length. You could do a little front tuck and that's super cute. You could also unbutton all the way. I think anyway. and just wear it as a cardigan. We'll see what that looks like. So I'd probably wear like a t-shirt or something under it and be just super casual with it. But yeah, that's, it's pretty cute. All right, I think it's recap time. Alrighty, time for a recap. The oversized knit card by Mac and Tan, uh, that was 48. The 1.5 inch hammered hoop by Amano Studio, 38. Alex short sleeve twist top by Gilly, 38. Corinne button cardigan, petite principle, that's this one, 52. The Petite Christina 
plaid shirt by Claudia Richard, 48. The 26 inch Julissa signature legging by Liss, Lisse, I don't know, uh, 52. So the subtotal is 276. You also get $25 credit back because that is the styling fee. And I do have a little bit of credit it says on here. So I don't know, maybe I'll get something. Maybe I'll wait till the next time. I don't know, what do you guys think? Did you like this? I do kind of like those earrings and I do really like the leggings too. I will check in my closet and see if, if I have a need for those. Uh, I think the rest of the stuff's gonna go back. Yeah, that's a short story. So I did start a Facebook page that is what Joe wore, which is my um, closet that I am getting rid of. So I've been cleaning out my closet for the last couple of years and I am selling everything. So head over there, what Joe wore. I will put a link below, click on it, like it, and then I'll start posting albums soon. I did get a little bit up yesterday. I'm kind of just going to go little by little. So um, I will ship to you. You can pick up if you are local. So yeah, getting rid of stuff. Thanks for watching guys and have a great day.